Cyclozar sucks. Sounds like the name of an antibiotic you would take if you got gonorrhea or something. You know what I mean? Like, does it burn when you pee? Ask your doctor about Cyclozar. That's that's totally what I hear. Not from uh, like personal experience or anything. Gosse Fleur. Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh! No fucking way, dude. I'm gonna stay with you, Eric, so Stephen can't kill us. <laughs> Let's fucking go. What is up, Killer Collective? Mount Kilimanjaro here, bringing you a battle of the new Paldean Fates Pokemon Center ETB and a box of Shiny Treasures EX. They cost about the same, uh, value-wise. I wanna see which one gives me the better pulls. What's better to spend my $60 on? Let's find out. How's everybody doing today? I'm doing just fine, thanks for asking. Um, like I said in the beginning, you know, this is, they cost about the same, about $60 each. Uh, Paldean Fates is new. Some of the card prices, like Iono is already below $100, and Iono in this set is well above $100. So I just want to see which one is the better bang for your buck. If you're going to spend 60 bucks, I mean, if you don't care between English and Japanese, which one is best for you to spend your money on? All right, let's get into it. I'm going to start off opening the Paldean Fates. I don't really care about the box too much. I'm not going to look at the book or anything. I'm not going to waste your time. You probably already watched a bunch of videos. A bunch of people got early product. It's really not that big of a deal these days. You do get the sick-ass Mimikyu promo, which is definitely an advantage over the Shiny Treasures. Which, I mean, they're going to make so many of these that the promos aren't going to be very valuable. And of course, in the Pokemon Center ETBs, you get a copy, a regular copy, and a Pokemon Center copy. So, I can't really just leave that right there. Also, if you're into, uh, you know, damage counters and energy bricks and stuff like that, um, then you do get a little bit of extra value with the ETB. Slide these over to the left. Make sure you guys uh, smash that like button for me. Subscribe to the channel if you're not. And consider turning on notifications. If you like free Pokemon cards, I stream every Friday night and uh, the end of every month, and I just give away a ton of Pokemon stuff. I'm recording this on a Friday. It probably won't post till Saturday. But on tonight's Friday night stream, there's 14 free booster box cards in the hitbox. There's alt arts, free ETBs, free slabs in there. So it's pretty crazy. Definitely come through if you can. All right, let's start it off with Paldean Fates. I haven't watched a ton of Paldean Fates openings. I usually don't before a set comes out just because I like to have a little a little new new for me, a little newness, you know what I'm saying? Let's see if we can get a hit from our first pack here. We've got a Nimona, a Charmander, Rare Candy, Frigabax, Atticus, Mousehold. There's an Iono, not the one we're looking for. Got a Flittle Reverse. A Scrafty Reverse and a Hollow Golden Go. No hit for our first pack. That's too bad. That is too bad. I've seen some pretty crazy ETBs. I've also seen some pretty terrible ETBs. So, who knows? Maybe we'll get lucky. Pokemon Center ETBs aren't something I normally open, but I thought it would be a good uh, value comparison since they cost about the same as the Shiny Treasures EX boxes. All right, we got a Fido, Pikachu. We got a Dodrio, a Starmie, we got the Glitter Hollow Pattern Sneasel, and we got a Quake of All EX. So I'm totally gonna assume that we'll get more hits in the Shiny Treasure, you know, because Japanese boxes are pretty much guaranteed a certain number of hits. But I do think we have a shot to pull some crazy bangers. I did see an ETB the other day, someone pulled the Mew SIR and the Charizard SIR from the same ETB. And then later on, they opened another ETB and it had the Mu SIR and the Iono SIR. So there are some broken ETBs out there. Surrey Ledge, Reverse Rare, Scraggy. Hey, we got a Judge Full Art. Let's fucking go. Judge cards are usually pretty good, pretty playable in the game. Um, I'm not sure, you know, I can't, can't assume, but for the most part, they usually are uh, pretty helpful to those who play the TCG. All right, so I'd say Paldean Fates is currently in the lead. I'll take a full art trainer over a uh, Quake of All EX any day. All right, come on. We got a Mastiff, a Gita. Shout out to the Gita gang. <clears throat> we got a Kadabra Glitter Pattern. 
And we got a Glamora EX. Nothing but EXs so far. All right, Palpe and Fates, you're back up. <clears throat> Come on, baby. Let's pull a banger. Let's pull a Cherry Zard. A little Cherry Zard action for old Mount Killer. How about it? Dollar Baby Shiny. There we go. Our first Baby Shiny. Got a Natu. And a Raichu. No Charizard in that pack. I mean, also you get the codes for the TCG, right? I mean, some people are love to do the online TCG, so that's an, an, another additional value you get from the Puppy and Faith, if you're into that. All right, Shiny Treasure, you're up. Come on, banger time. Raichu. Garganical. And we got a baby Shiny Oddish. Or, uh, uh, Gloom. <laughs> Oddish. Gloom's a spitter, not a swallower. Look at that. Happy, too. Gloom loves getting that on his face. I'm telling you what. And we got a Mew EX. All right. So we're definitely getting more hits out of Shiny Treasure. I've also noticed on a little bit of Paldean Faith videos I've watched that uh, IRs are a lot easier to pull than the ARs were in Shiny Treasure EX, which is uh, interesting. Not sure why. Not sure why they decided that should be different. Swoobat, Nimona's backpack. I wonder what she's got in there. Now I'm super curious, Nimona. What do you carry in that backpack? Probably tampons. I think maybe pads, maybe she's not a tampon lady. I don't know, they got all kinds of cool like period stuff that I don't even know, like cups. Like how does a period cup work? You just wedge it in there and it catches the blood. It's kind of nasty, I don't know. I don't know. What, does it not spill? Is it actually in there? Is it like strapped to it? I got all kinds of questions. I'm gonna have to be Googling stuff later. Hopefully Mrs. Killer doesn't look at my search history. She's gonna think I'm pretty weird. Mimikyu. Hey, Charmeleon, let's go. Love me some Charmander, Charmeleon, and or Charizards. Now we got a Coridon. These nuts, EX. I'd say with that Charmeleon, without looking at the values, I'd say the maybe shiny treasures in the lead now we're not going to just base our opinion on values though grap locked grap lock shouldn't exist it should only be clobopus clobopus for life oh mu x full art shiny let's fucking go take that come on one more hit baby and a cyclozar that is not a hit cyclozar sucks sounds like the name of an antibiotic you would take if you got gonorrhea or something you know what i mean like does it burn when you pee? Ask your doctor about Cyclozar. That's that's totally what I hear. Not from uh, like personal experience or anything. Anyway, you guys are getting me off topic here. Veluza, Obama Snow, Full Art Shiny um, Iron Treads EX. That's unfortunate for the Full Art Shiny. We got the Glitter Voltorb. Yeah, dang it. That's the problem with only getting one Full Art Shiny EX per box. Like if you get that or Claude Sire or any number of other terrible Pokemon, like that's what you got, man. It's tough. Natsu, Curlia, Nimona's Backpack, Whimsicott, Kill a Watch will reverse. Ooh, Nimona, SIR, let's fucking go. Let's go, Nimona. Maybe we can ask her what's in her backpack now. And a Mabastiff Hollow. Pokemon Center ETB hooking me up. Usually they let me down, like bad, down bad. Usually I'm like upset that I even opened it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy. All right, let's keep it going, Shiny Treasure. You can still give me an SIR or a Baby Shiny Pikachu. There's still some value that could be had. Hey, we got a Baby Shiny Slowbro. I like Slowbro, Slowpoke, Slow King. And we got a Fortress EX. All right, not bad. Mime Jr. Get out of here, Mime Jr. Nobody likes you. All right, come on, Paldean Fates. You're doing me so good, and we still got a bunch of packs left. I, I totally believe in you that you can make this an epic ETB. Charmeleon, star you, baby shiny. Hiya. Magmar. And a Zatu. It's all right. Got a baby shiny now, one can't complain. 
the sheer size of these sets is insane. Like, I feel bad for anyone trying to master. At least they're going to be cheap, especially uh, Paldean Fates. Like, all these baby shinies are going to be cheap as hell. If you can wait, if you're patient and smart but with your money, you can finish these sets without having to try too hard and spend too much money. Shinx! Shout out to Shinx, bro. We caught him on my LFG lock, right? my custom shining play, uh, pearl playthrough. And I named him Willard after my cat. Yeah, we got a Gardevoir. Shout out to Sav and Brass. I don't know if there's some psychological thing there with liking Gardevoir that much. There's uh, some pretty, pretty inappropriate uh, fanfic when it comes to Gardevoir out in the community. That's what I heard anyway, and I could see it. Gardevoir got them nice curves. Electric Generator, Raichu, Lapras, shout out to Ren, Magmortar. Come on, baby. Never mind. I don't know why I said, come on, baby, like there was going to be another card back there. Whatever, bro. I'm just rolling with it. At this point in the video, if you have not smashed that like button or subscribe to the channel, please do. Have a good time. Have some fun. Give some shit away. All right, come on. Ah, Iron Treads EX. No, thank you. You may ask yourself, Mount Killer, why are you making this video? You don't normally make these kind of videos. The reason I don't is because this was an expensive video, man. I think that box of Shiny Treasure was 50 bucks. And um, this Pokemon Center ETB was like 60 bucks or 55, I don't even remember. Pineco, hey, my boy Clavipus, look at that. That is artwork. This is the best hit in the set right here. That should be in a museum. Look at that shit. Bro, screw the Van Gogh Pikachu. Give me that, uh, give me that Clavipus. And a Gardevoir EX, we're matching with Gardevoirs here. I'm actually gonna set that Clavipus out. I might send that off for grading. There's not a lot of good Clavipus cards to uh, send off for grading. Like, he's been let down, he needs an IR. AR. AR first since it'll come out in Japanese. And then IR for us, he deserves it. Always doing my boy dirty. Come on, ah, now Skirata. It's not what we're after. All right, we're down to two packs of Paldean Fates. Did have one more pack, I believe, in the ETB. It should have been 11. So even though we started on Paldean Fates, we are going to end on Paldean Fates as well. Artisan, Numel, come on, Mimikyu. Screw you, Mimikyu. All right, we are on our last pack of Shiny Treasure EX, guys. Let me know down in the comments, what do you want me to pull out of this pack? I hope it's a Charizard, because I like Charizard. And don't judge me for liking Charizard. There's nothing wrong with liking things that are cool. Wug Trio, Glitter. Ah, now a Kazam EX. That was not it. I don't know. I don't think Shiny Treasure is going to beat Paldean Fates on this one. We got the Nimona. We got the Full Art Shiny Mew. We got the Judge Full Art. Let's see if we can add to it a little, little cherry on top of this delicious Mount Killa Sunday. You don't want to know what goes in the Mount Killa Sunday to make it so delicious, trust me. Maybe you do. I don't know what you're into. I'm not here to judge. Obama Snow Baby Shiny. Tandem Mouse. And a hollow professor's reach. Oh well. At least we ended on a baby shiny. Alright, let's take a look. I'm gonna gather this up real quick. And I will cut back when I have it all put together. I'm gonna sleeve everything up first so I don't scratch it up. So I'll be right back. One minute, 37 seconds later. Alright, I sleeved everything up. Let's uh, let's do a little comparison. We'll start with Paldean Fates. We ended up with this Gardevoir EX. Our only EX out of the entire ETB, which is kind of weird. We also didn't get any IRs. We got a baby shiny Staryu, a baby shiny Obama Snow, a baby shiny Dolive. We got the Mew EX Full Art Shiny. We got the Judge Full Art, the Nimona SIR, and we have the two Mimikyu promos. There is usually isn't much value in this regular one, but there is sometimes value on this Pokemon Center one. It just depends on how many ETBs they print and everything. I do think this will be a popular one. It's a cool artwork. Got Whistler's mother over here knitting. Mimikyu just staring all creepily. I was looking at the quality on some of my cards, maybe for, potentially for grading, but like some of the corners are pretty beat. Thanks a lot, Pokemon TPCI. 
A lot of people ask why. Why treat the customer this way? Why? Because fuck them, that's why. All right, now let's review the shiny treasures. We got the same Gardevoir EX. We got an Iron Treads EX. Glare as shit. Mouscarada EX. Kadabra EX, or Alakazam EX, my bad. Fortress EX. Karate on these nuts EX. Mew EX. Glamora EX. Quaquaval EX. So we got nine EXs and 10 packs, which is pretty crazy. Um, that's an insane number. It feels like that's way more than you're supposed to get. <clears throat> we got the Baby Shiny Slowbro, which I like. We got the Baby Shiny Gloom. We got the Baby Shiny Ch uh, Charmeleon, which I'm in love with. I think that's a great card. And then for our full art shiny, we ended up with an Iron Treads EX. So obviously, I mean, Paldean Fates had to win, right? We got an SIR. We got a full art trainer. We got a much better full art shiny Pokemon. Our um, baby shinies are worse, unfortunately. We got way less EXs, but let's be honest. I'm not in this to open EX cards. We want the bangers. We want the big baller cards. And that was the Nimona. So shout out to Paldean Fates. Let's go, America. Suck it, Japan. We are number one. F you. All right, that's it. I'm out of here. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had a good time. Thank you guys so much for watching. Smash that like, subscribe if you haven't. Show your boys some love. Catch me on a live stream. Win some free shit. Later, everybody.